Good morning. My name is Cesar Jaramillo. I am a second year theologian studying for the Diocese of Patterson, currently at the North American College in Rome. God willing, my diaconate ordination will take place October of 2016 and my priesthood ordination would be scheduled for May 2017. Well, I think they all played a very important role, but if I was to point out one specifically, it would be the Sea of Galilee. Um, I think because it was there three years ago that I answered the Lord's call. Um, and so coming now as a seminarian, after having completed three years of formation for the priesthood, um, not only was it a spiritual nourishment, but it was also a renewal of my vocation. I would just like to, first of all, thank each and every one of you and encourage uh, all of you to keep supporting this wonderful pilgrimage, especially for us uh, who are aspiring to the priesthood. I think it is important to retrace the steps of our Lord. And uh, as a biblical scholar friend of mine, Father Bill Burton once said, I think after visiting the Holy Land, uh, you never read scripture the same way again. Uh, so that being the basis of our formation, I think will enhance the whole priesthood formation program. Absolutely, I think I would greatly encourage them to participate in the pilgrimage, not only because it's a once in a lifetime experience, but because I really think uh, it's, it's spiritual nourishment uh, to follow in the footsteps of our Lord. And it is important for us to, to know the roots and the truth of our faith from a historical point of view as well. I did, there wasn't any time in which I felt, um, you know, aside from there is a tension in the political conflict, but at no time did I feel threatened or that my security was at stake. Absolutely, one can't help, but if it feels special right now as a seminarian, I think it would be even much more enriching as a priest to be able to celebrate the Holy Sacrament of the Eucharist in all the places where tradition holds it. Our Lord was on his journey here on earth.